Twins earlier this week said, hey, come to Target Field and watch the game in Houston. There was a lot of us who kind of wondered um, how many of you would actually show up. It turns out it was a lot. And one of them was our own Mary McGuire, who was not surprised by any of it. Well, why watch the game at home when you can watch it here at Target Field with a couple thousand of your closest friends? Hey, Justin Verlander is very beatable. Their team was playing more than a thousand miles away in Texas, but the stands at Target Field were still filled with optimism and enthusiasm for the Twins. We won two playoff games in a row now, and it's like a new era of Twins baseball. Target Field hosted a free watch party for fans, filling up portions of the ballpark with folks who weren't afraid to brave the chilly October weather. We have players that can play pretty much anywhere. It's amazing, we're yeah. deep. And then the pitching, well. Sue Claire and her friends aren't just fans. <laughs> They're super fans. We'll do a little twirl. Claire is a retired teacher and began following the twins intensely <laughs> after one pivotal moment in her career. One of my students, all he wanted was a game ball, and he was going through a real hard time at home, and I got a game ball for him. I didn't catch it, but somebody around me did. I brought him up on a stool and presented the, he gave me his mitt. It was, it was amazing. Of course, Saturday's game did not go in the Twins' favor, but these Twins faithful aren't giving up hope just yet. We have World Series tickets on our phone, ready to go. You do? Yeah, ready to go, oh ready to be activated. They don't, they don't have the barcode yet, but they will when we get there. The Twins will be back here at Target Field on Tuesday. Reporting from Target Field tonight, Mary McGuire, Fox 9.